over the past years, digital currency development uh, have been uh, in the news for a number of stakeholders from central banks, international organizations to private sector um, that have been experimenting with uh, digital currencies. Um, digital currencies will need international standards uh, and collaboration at the international level in order to reach scale and achieve uh, its objectives. Um, and the, the initiative, the Digital Currency Global Initiative, is a really a collaboration between ITU and the Future of Digital Currency Initiative at Stanford University. Uh, it was set up in 2020 following the completion of the uh, ITU focus group on digital currency, including digital fiat currency. And its main objectives is really to provide a platform for dialogue among the uh, diverse stakeholders, the digital stakeholders and the banking uh, stakeholders when it comes to um, central bank uh, digital currencies. Um, it has a research component to bring uh, the top minds uh, in the industry and academia around this topic um, to construct a set of metrics uh, by which to evaluate the robustness of various uh, digital currency technologies against uh, the requirements that were uh, set out by the uh, stakeholders to identify areas of uh, standardization. And this is really where the ITU comes in to look at what can we standardize to enable the implementation of digital currency, especially given that we have a mandate from our member states to look at financial inclusion. Uh, and we look at the interplay between digital currencies and financial inclusion. And of course, to organize a conference on an annual basis to share the information on the best practices, uh, the technical standards and the lessons learned on digital currency implementations. So in a nutshell, this um, initiative is really to have an engagement uh, to look at the innovative use and the standardization of digital currencies. And we're structured in um, three groups or three um, areas of work, uh, the architecture interoperability requirements and use cases, the policy and governance, and the security and assurance. So the uh, DC3 conference from cryptocurrencies to CBDCs aims to bring together industry uh, thought leaders, policy makers, uh, standards development bodies, international organizations, central banks, digital currency platform providers, uh, stablecoin and cryptocurrency industry experts to exchange and dialogue and share their experience and pilot project uh, implementations. Uh, it's also an, an interdisciplinary platform for uh, researchers, practitioners and industry to uh, present and discuss the most recent innovation, uh, trends and standards, as well as uh, practical challenges uh, encountered uh, during this journey to develop uh, this new area of, uh, of work. Uh, the conference is organized by the uh, Digital Currency Global Initiative, which is a joint collaboration of the ITU and the Future Digital Currency Initiative at Stanford University. Uh, DC3 will be held between the 25th and 27th of January 2022 and will highlight the work of the Digital Currency Global Initiative as well as the emerging industry trends and initiatives in digital currency, in particular to regards to sharing insights, discussing emerging developments, conducting deep dives uh, sessions, uh, such as interoperability for central bank digital currency, stable coins, and securing the digital currency systems, and fostering the dialogue. Really, uh, the key here is the dialogue among digital ecosystem stakeholders and regulators on key lessons learned from digital cryptocurrency or currency pilots and implementations. Uh, the three days uh, will consist of three thematic tracks on central bank digital currencies, stable coins and security. So two on three deep dives sessions on interoperability for central bank digital currencies, implement implementing interoperability for stable coins and security validation model for digital currency system uh, systems and three high-level panel discussion on topics such as the efficiencies that uh, stable coins can bring to financial inclusion and to payment systems, architecture models for CBDC and stablecoin implementations, definition of a digital currency ontology model, and security assurance for digital currency systems, amongst others. <music> <music>